Hello, Louisiana Beer Reviews. Oh. With dog appearances. Uh, <laughs> we're live. We're not going to let him drink it, don't worry. Oh. You might need to tell that a little bit. We're live from Alabama. Well, live on recording from Alabama. We're doing it live, is what I mean. And, uh, we're doing a beer called Dr. Robot. It's very lemon sour. Back it up a little bit. Sure. I'm not in the frame. Yeah, Justin oh, yeah. Okay. got some arm room on the side, so I think you could like... We try to do good beer reviews, but our production value is not the best. Okay. Um, <laughs> I'm over here. <laughs> so I'm saying you need to be tilted. Alright. Um, it's fine. Ale with berries and lemon. 5%, so it's not strong. Independent crab brewer. Okay, got a good date. Got a good date. And this is from uh, Monday Night Brewing in Atlanta, Georgia. Nice label. And there is, a there is a location of Monday Night Brewing in Birmingham. Where? Beehem. In Birmingham. Mm -hmm. It's like rose wine. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. I remember I had this beer like three years ago. We used hmm. to sell it at a restaurant I worked at. I think I tried it on draft there. When we when we went? Don't, did, didn't that one of the ones I tried? Mm -hmm. I tried an IPA. I think I tried this one. Yeah, we had we had a, we had a few. <laughs> few Is Wilson trying to get some? Rare rare form today. Well, I think Wilson was trying to give him a kiss. Aww. He put us yeah. that all the backwards. Back. I've, I've tried a couple beers from them, and I've I've liked the beers I've had, so I. I don't know if that's a good or bad thing, but I have high expectations for this, if I remember what it is. It looks like a ruby, it does look like rosé, or like a ruby grapefruit juice. Yeah, it's a little too dark for rosé, I guess I retract that. Yeah, I've had it before, I like it. No, I mean, I've had some it's dark, been a while, dank, fun, fun rosés so like a, this. A pink head and a, what, what's that color? Bubbles. Pink. Off white. Kind of orange a pink, a pink head and kind of orange, yeah, orange, yeah. pink, orange. Peachy. Pink orange? All right, so the aroma. Wilson's just staring at you so intensely. What do you think, Wilson? He did not like the smell. You don't like it? He doesn't like it. Well, you know, he's I'm not, not picking up much aroma, honestly. No, no it smells like a generic beer it's smell. Neutral, yeah, it's neutral. Yeah. So neutral. That's a nicer way than saying generic. Yeah. Good, good appearance. Bad score on aroma because there is none. I guess a non-score. Now the flavor. Cheers. Cheers. It's not very sour, is it? It's not very flavorful today. Oh. Maybe it's just the one we got. I don't know. Right. It tastes flat. It's flat. flat. That is yeah. what I was thinking too. Yeah. yeah. It, we might just have gotten a bad. That's weird. Can. Oh, okay. So it I taste it a little bit. There's a yeah. prickly carbonation on my tongue. Yeah. It's not super carbonated. Um, a little syrupy. From I guess the uh, berries. Whatever berries those are in lemon, maybe it's blackberries. Um, I'm not. It's, it's very it's blackberries. It's light. Yeah, it's very light. I get honestly, I get the berry more than I do the lemon, and I hardly get the berry. The lemon is in the like, very back for me, and the lemon stays for a while, but it's all the berry and lemon flavor are very subtle. I'm thinking now maybe it's blackberries and blueberries. You can see that. There's like definitely that. blackberry in there. It was like the opposite of the sour we had earlier. Really like not like, in the face. I feel like in the past it's had more uh, powerful flavor. This one. Yeah, mm -hmm. and I don't know if it's just that whatever I drank before kind of muted the flavor. I don't know. But I also think I think this would be a really approachable sour, but if I'm someone who likes sours, this is not the one I would reach for. This would be yeah. a no. this would be one I'd reach for to introduce someone to a sour, but it's also yeah, it's like but yeah. I feel like it's, it's pretty calm. Yeah, my I feel like it would create false expectations for that person. They might be like, oh, a sour, and then they would try like the trim tab one or the good people, and they'd be like, whoa. Medium body, moderate sweetness, no bitterness, some, tart, some tartness. Almost oh. reminds me more of uh, some gozes that I've had. Yeah. Probably no salt, but it doesn't yeah. salt. Um, I like it, but um, it's I mean, not amazing or anything. Honestly, this is one of the most underwhelming things I've drank in a long time. Oh, man. <laughs> like, it, there's just, it, she's always here with the harsh criticism. <laughs> I just feel like it doesn't. So people worked really hard to make this, Elizabeth, and that's great. But and they should have worked a little. <laughs> they should have worked a little hard. Berry almost tasted nothing. Lemon hardly present. Sour, it's not. So it just has a flat, muted taste. 
And there's like some kind of something off putting. I, I'm not, yeah. I am picking up. I love the can it. design, but that's the Dude, most I can say about it. Yeah, that's pretty. Go ahead. I'm sorry. picking up a little bitterness now, but you know where the bitterness I'm is coming from? <laughs> you know where the bitterness is coming from? Where? Tannins, like mm -hmm. blackberry skin or blueberry skin. You know how a berry like skin will tannin. have tannins? It's like bitter. Even tea or. Uh, you know, grapes will have that bitterness from the skin, but uh, that's that's not even a strong flavor. I like it personally. I, I give it like a B, like an eighty-three. Like it's good, but just kind of like. Good. He almost never goes that low too. This is kind of. Well, I feel like I've had it before and it's been better. So like maybe they're it's just a little inconsistent. Mm -hmm. I don't know because like this doesn't. This is underwhelming compared to. Right. It wasn't amazing. It was. But I mean, like, it, it was still better than this the last yeah. time I had it. If you just gave this to me in a glass, you didn't tell me what it was, you didn't tell me berry, lemon, sour, any of that, you're just like, oh, here's a beer, you know, I wouldn't hate it, I'd just be like, oh, it's just some lightly flavored light beer that I don't yeah. really know what the taste is, you know, yeah. I, I wouldn't, but the fact, flat. Yeah. the fact that I'm going into it with these flavor expectations that aren't delivering, I really, I can't. Yeah, you said you blindfold when you have it, no yeah. context. Yeah, it's I'm going to give it a C, a high C. Because it's not repulsive. Like a C plus. Yeah, the flavor is fine, but this is like you well, know. Repulsive would be a D. That would yeah. Be bad. So it's like you know, if a student turned in a paper that was a C, I mean, they still passed, but it. I mean. They might want to not pick that from a. They might want to do some revision. So I, I just, again, it's not the worst thing I've ever had, but it's very underwhelming, especially considering the flavor notes and even just the the marketing, like. You know, this can, it's all like, oh, lightning, you know, little aliens, like it, it like, there's, there's a, the marketing and the labels like conveying an energy that the beer is just not. Yeah, yeah. Not really a robot. Okay. Yeah, exactly, exactly. The lightning bolts make me think it'll be a zingy sour, you know, with lemon, but it's not. Yeah. I still, I, I still think it's a crushable, like, summer beer. Like, I would... Oh, yeah, you can knock it back. I would, I would actually rate it an 85, because I, I, I think it tastes good. Honestly, I think it tastes good. It's a crushable, easy drinking, but it doesn't deliver on what it says it does. So you're saying, like, a, a B, I'm saying a B, a little lower. You're saying a C plus, like 78. Maybe a B minus. No, you, don't have to, feels, you don't have to yeah. adjust your score. Is it when I was teaching? Like, oh, I don't know. Maybe. No, my, my, a <laughs> friend of mine, a friend of mine does beer reviews with me, with me, and then we'll cut the camera off. He's like, I really wanted to give it a little score. It's really not that good. I said, Well, then give it the score you wanted to give it. Don't yeah. come off camera yeah. and tell me it really wasn't that good. You don't have to like compensate for something. You just give the score. So whatever you score you honestly feel, give it. Yeah, I guess a seventy-nine or eighty. Okay, so we'll say eighty. Okay. A B minus. Okay. Um, so I, I've had it. I, I think it has more potential than this can. Like I, maybe there's a transport issue. I don't know. I don't know how beer can change flavor like that. <laughs> yeah. But anyway, um, so I, I'm gonna say a 91 just based on my other experiences with this beer. Yeah. Um, and I mean, yeah. And and for you know, it was still drinkable. So. All right. So we're gonna cut the camera off. And so ladies and gentlemen, Tom Lay, we're gonna say go to Atlanta and tour Monday night brewing. I'll Maybe it'll taste better. Yeah. I bet it will because it's live. It's fresh. It's 